Well, right, it's a uh, 10 inch 7J RPM shellac record on Rex label. Roy Barber, who I know from that uh, much uh, recorded uh, and very beautiful uh, comic song with a head tucked underneath her arm. This is uh, his version of the Runcorn Ferry, which uh, I've previously shared with you uh, with uh, Stanley Holloway doing this uh, this uh, number, which is uh, Runcorn's in Cheshire, up north in, in uh, north of England, uh, sort of Lancashire way, and I'm not sure if Roy Barber is actually of that uh, extraction or not, but uh, Stanley Holloway was actually an East Londoner, so he's putting on an accent, he was very good at accents. So here's Roy Barber's version. Tuppence per person per trip is sort of subtitled, that's really what the, the story is about. On the banks of the Mersey, over on Cheshire side, lies rum corn that's best known to fame. By transport a bridge as tax folks over the stream, or else brings them back across same. In days afore transport a bridge were put up, a ferry boat lay in the slip, and old Ted the boatman would row folks across, at per tuppence per person per trip. One evening, to Ted's super latest surprise, Three customers came into view. A Mr. and Mrs. Ramsbottom, it were, and Albert, their little son, too. How much for the three, Mr. Ramsbottom asked, as his hand to his pocket did dip. Ted said same for three as it would be for one, per tuppence, per person, per trip. You're not charging tuppence for that little lad, said Mother, her eyes flashing wild. Per tuppence, per person, per trip, answered Ted. Per woman, per man, or per child. Five pence per three, that's the most that I'll pay, said Father. Don't waste time in talk. Per tuppence, per person, per trip, answered Ted. And them as can't pay has to walk. We can walk and all, said Father. Come, Mother, it's non sedate. Weather's quite mild. So into the water the three of them stepped. The father, the mother, the child. The further they paddled, the deeper it got. But they wouldn't give in once begun. In the spirit that's made Lancashire what she is, they'd sooner be drowned than done. Very soon the old people were up to their necks, and the little lad clean out of sight. Said father, where's Albert? And mother replied, I've got hold of his hand, he's all right. Well, just at that moment, Pa got an idea, and floundering back to old Ted, he said, we've walked that way. Come, take us the rest for our price, that's a penny a head. But Ted wasn't standing for none of that there, and making an obstinate lip. Per tuppence, per person, per trip, Ted replied per trip or per part of per trip. All right then, said father, let me tack the boat and I'll pick up the others halfway. I'll roll them across and I'll bring the boat back and thruppence in bargain I'll pay. He got mother out. It were rather a job. With the water she weighed half a ton. Then pushing the oar down the side of the boat, started fishing around for his son. When poor little Albert came up to the top, his collar was soggy and limp. And with holding his breath at the bottom so long, his face were as red as a shrimp. Pa took them across and he brought the boat back. And he said to old Ted on the slip, Will row me across by myself? Ted said, aye, at per tuppence per person per trip. When they got to the side, father laughed it to bust. He got best at bargain, you see. He'd worked it all out and he got his own way. And he'd paid nob at five pence for three.